Is this the best pressure washer that you can buy for less than £240? Well today on Fix It With Fowler I'm going to be putting this through its paces to find out all the pros and cons of this Nilfisk Core 150. Let's see what you get in the box with this Nilfisk Core 150. The first thing is obviously the pressure washer and that comes with this collapsible handle which is ideal for storage. The next thing you get is a 360 degree rotating spray gun, an extension lance, a foam spray bottle, a rough nozzle and a fully adjustable gentle nozzle. The final thing is an integral 10 meter Ultraflex hose that can be stored within the unit itself. Like most people, I use my pressure washer for cleaning the decking, cleaning the patio and cleaning my van. So the first thing you need to do before you actually use the pressure washer is pull out your Ultraflex hose and then attach your gun. Now the gun is a click and clean system that literally just pushes in once you hear that click that means it's seated properly and you'll see it's got a 360 degree rotation that ensures nothing gets tangled before you use your pressure washer the next thing is to plug this lance into the gun and that's just a simple connection and then you can choose which accessory is suitable for what you're going to be using the pressure washer for there is a rough cleaning nozzle there's a gentle adjustable nozzle and there's a foam bottle that I'm going to be using for the van. You can then get the bottle and click straight into the lance and you're ready to go. Now you can choose the power control for the cleaning you're going to be doing. There's a full list on the back of the machine that tells you what's suitable, but I think it's more a trial and error. <laughs> And now you can rinse off the van using this gentle nozzle and it's fully adjustable so you can have a spray pattern like this or you can adjust it and have something like this. So there's loads of other attachments you can get for your pressure washer from Nilfisk and one thing I've opted for is this and it's actually an auto soft brush that comes with a squeegee on the back and it's ideal for soft sensitive surfaces including your windows so if your windows are filthy like ours you can use this give them a bit of a rub wash off the excess and then you can flip it over and squeegee the window dry so what sets this apart from the competition is one amazing feature that i've only just discovered you don't actually need to plug this onto an outside tap. You can actually put a filter kit onto a water bowl or some sort of water container, which means that this is not relying on an outside water supply. With this Nilfisk system, there's loads of different attachments for different jobs. Now for cleaning your patio, you could use something like this rough attachment, attachment which will give a real harsh clean, or you can use a dedicated patio cleaner like this. Now this is fully adjustable and you can turn that up or down depending on what you're going to clean. So if it's something delicate, you could actually turn that down to preserve the patio itself. Have you subscribed to my channel? I've got over 80 different DIY videos on my channel, all designed to save you money by giving you the confidence and the knowledge to tackle these jobs yourself. So head over, hit that subscribe button because I'm sure there's something for you. Right, if you're interested in getting one of these Nilfisk pressure washers, then all you need to do is go down in the description and you'll see a link directly to the website. Head over, put in this code and that will save you some money and hopefully get you a good deal on one of these pressure washers.
Now the patio cleaner is attached to the lance. It's fully adjustable, like I said before, depending on what you're going to clean. So if you have it on the lowest setting and press the gun, that will start to clean the patio, but it is quite gentle. If we turn it up, and now you can see just how effective this patio cleaner is. This patio was cleaned two months previous, and you can see how much dirt is being lifted. So in the Nilfisk range for this pressure washer, there is a whole host of different attachments, which I think set this apart from the competition, and they're really useful to have. So the first thing is there's a multi-brush kit attachment. There's a 15 meter adjustable pole for cleaning your roofs and your gutters. And there's also a self-propelling drain cleaner, which I'm gonna be using in an up and coming video. Now you've finished with the pressure washer itself, you just twist that 90 degrees and then put that into the holder. Now, one thing you will see is that it's got a serrated bottom and that means that any water will drain out of it, which is a really good feature. Now, before you release this bit, press the trigger, release any pressure out of the system, press that in and that just comes out and the gun stores in exactly the same way. Now, this Ultraflex hose is 10 meters long and they say it doesn't kink when you store it back in. So let's see, you just wind this in like so. And that is it all stored away, really simple and self-contained. The final thing you need to do is press in these two buttons and fold the handle down and you can store it nice and neatly in your garage or your shed. So I hope you like that review of the Nilfisk Core 150 pressure washer. My personal opinion is it's a really good piece of kit. There's got some really useful features, especially the self-contained hose. So if you head over to the website, I've put a link in the description and also the discount code. So hopefully you'll get quite a good deal on this bit of kit.